What's going on everyone? It's Cake out here and welcome back to NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup as we are back in Fight to its Hot Mode. The third part, or the fourth part of this, no, the third part is, it's the fourth part of the series, sorry, the fourth part of this series as we are going to head to the first race of the, <clears throat> as we're going to head to another race in the Modified Series, Nazareth Speedway. Let's do it. Take it away, uh, <clears throat> uh, I forgot who it was. <laughs> Alan Vesla, there you go, Alan Vesla, take it away. Welcome to Pennsylvania for today's running of the Lehigh Valley 150. As one of the longest tracks on the NASCAR Featherlight Modified Series circuit, these drivers will have to pay close attention to their speed and hit their marks perfectly as they make their way around this one-mile track. We're just a few minutes from the start of this race on behalf of EA Sports. We hope you enjoy all the racing action here at Nazareth. Alright, so let me go to the car setup. We're going to adjust the tire pressure again, 20 PSI. Uh, okay, the front spring's already lowered. We're gonna lower the wedge just in case uh, it gets too tight out there. And let's qualify this bad boy. Off the last corner, first lap of 26.23. I think this one's a little slower, unfortunately. And it is. <coughs> so we're starting 8th. That's on the outside. I want to get to the bottom as soon as possible, so let's see how that goes. This definitely won't be one of my, one of my best tracks. I have not raced this one in a long time either, so. Just like I said, Old Spice Speedway, I haven't been checking all the time. Alright, let's do this. And the green flag is out, 18 laps. Oh cool, there's a rival in front of me again. Just like last race. Oh god, I'm gonna make a rival and start this race too, aren't I? And we dropped back the spot because we couldn't quite get to the bottom. I didn't feel anything wrong with the setup, so I, le I left it as is. And hopefully it's gonna, s hopefully it's not gonna get too tight on me as the race goes on. Yeah, driving deep in the three if I want that. Oh god. Sorry, Richie Reed. I still got Carmen inside after all that. Darn it. Okay, there we go. Wait, not to be. I got a little, little more rivalry with him now. Great. Alright. Let's try to start catching up to those guys in front of us if we can. That's not gonna help the grass. That's one pass made, we're back where we started, and we got seven more to make and we want to win this race. And I think we can do it. We have plenty of laps to do it. Fourteen laps and get back to the line. So we should be able to get there. And one, ooh, two issues now, I think, is that one, we have to make sure we pass this guy cleanly, don't let, and then don't let anyone else pass this. And the second thing is that there's that rival again, so hopefully he doesn't retaliate on us and screw us out of a good finish. Really got around the inside Chuck Spicer there, and we made the pass for seven. Although we had to go through the grass to make it work, but whatever, it still worked, didn't it? So, oh god, Titan, Titan three and four, kind of was in that corner there. So, I guess you could consider this like Pocono, a, a small version of Pocono. So I guess that was turn three, really. So this is turn two, long turn two. Oh god, don't slide in this guy from from the outside here. Cleared us. Yeah, two there, and this is basically turn three. So, this is, that's all turn three. This is all turn three, I, I would say. Ah, uh, God! I just touched him. I couldn't. I was trying. I was there on his inside, and he couldn't quite give me a room. Made a little contact. Did we have the run off. The, we had the run off of two here, and just a little bit of a run, but not quite. And we should make the pass here for six, then we do, okay. Eleven laps to go. We can we can get this done. Oh god. We can get this done eleven to go, I think. So let's see how this goes. Okay, the guy behind me decided to be an idiot, try to get under me and then and slip into the wall. Cool. Glad I don't have to worry about him behind me now, as I can just focus on Paul Donnelly in front of me here. Hey, 
Made a little contact with him, but I made the pass work, and now we got our sights set on fourth. And if we don't win this race, this is a this is a good run in top five right now, so I'm okay with it at this point. But we, but I would really love to get a lot higher finish than what we have right now. Oh boy! Okay, we made it. Stick on the bottom for this fourth spot. We get the run off the two here. A little clear, nice. All right, so three more cars to pass and seven laps. And there's the pass for third. I hit him a little bit, but made the I made the pass. That's that's the nice most right there. I had a huge run off of three and four, and they kind of and it and the car kind of just. Slow down, and make sure you don't. I don't. Hit, I didn't hit the guy in the back uh, on the straight, so I was like, okay, fine, whatever. They're just gonna do that to me. But doesn't matter. Doesn't matter now. We're just gonna try to catch these last the top two in the last five laps. Damn it! I didn't mean to hit the wall there. I was just trying to keep it straight down the back, and I. Uh, messed up the t messed up turn two, and it was just uh, trying to. It was just fish towing on me like all over the place. I was trying to keep it straight and steady, but oh, we caught them again. We're st we we were gonna catch back up anyway, so right on the back bumper. We can get this done. With we can get this done as we come two to go. I think I I know we can. Oh, this is this has been so amazing to go from. And I feel like the car has gotten better as the race has gone on. Either that, or I'm just blurring the track a lot better. Clean pass for second. The chance for the lead right here. I'm going for it. I oh, I went for a little contact, but no harm, no foul. I took the lead. Oh my goodness. Now let's see if we can hold him off uh, for the last lap and a half. As we come to the white flag, he drifted up a bit as he's trying to get under me. Yeah, bow for second. Thank you. White flag. One to go. Oh my goodness. If this is Legend Difficulty, I would not want to see what happens in the next in upcoming series. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And it paid off the win at Nazareth. Yeah! Oh my goodness. That was... Absolutely amazing how I pulled that off. I really don't know how I pulled that off, to be honest. Oh my goodness. Victory Lane, I'm going to be coming for you again. That's two wins in a row. Two big wins. Oh my goodness. I love this season already, and I love this fight to the top already. It's like, but it's only, but it'll probably only get hard from here as soon as I uh, get to the truck series, and I know it's gonna come soon. Soon, soon enough, I keep playing like this. Woo! So two hundred eighty-four skill points earned, mostly probably because I led the, the last part of the last lap and a half. Now we have $81,570 in the bank. We've got the same amount as last time for winning this stuff. A little over $6,000 earned. Woo! 1101 prestige points, 16,600 fans, and 500 hero points. We finally got hero points for once. Who's this? <laughs> 50,000 fans. Still a long way to go, Ace Moneymaker, okay? Um, yeah. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna look at the point standards I've done, because that was nuts. I I really, I have to look at the point standards of that, because that is just ridiculous. Ah, I pulled that off. So let's see what we have here. 55 point lead on Danny Ross. Then it's George Myers, Elmer Padwell, dropped the fourth, but you know he's second points so. earlier. And George Jones fifth, 68 back, and... 
Who's last in the standings right now? Marvin Humphreys. Okay. Well, whatever. All right. Next race. It is Levi Strauss Central Speedway. Let's do it. EA Sports and the Levi Speedway would like to welcome you to today's race. Some of the best drivers of the NASCAR Featherlight Modified Series are here in Clearfield. We're expecting this one to go right down to the wire. Get ready. Get set. The green flag's only moments away. Marcus Strauss. All right. <coughs> High pressure again, gonna lower to 20, and then suspension. Looks pretty good, except for the fact that I'm gonna lower it away if I have to turn. And let's qualify. <laughs> There's no way I should have gotten the pole. I was pretty much going for it off the last corner, and it hit the wall, and I still ended up getting the pole by three one thousandths of a second. <laughs> Okay, first off, I'm gonna lower the wedge again, and I'm gonna lower the tire pressure just a little more because it's not, it's, it's a short track and stuff, so might as well. Let's do it! Three went down, but I still can't believe that. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. And yeah, we did not get the best of starts, but we can get the lead back easily, I know it. <clears throat> The short track has been quite a bit of a nightmare because the first time we raced that short track, which was the first race of the season, we did not really do as well as I hoped we would. Because I, we had to leave for a while, and then the tires started falling off, I think. So that was, there was that. And then also the game froze on me for about 10 seconds, so we also had that as well. I, I don't know. Everything's went wrong at some point or another. But we had the lead now, and we're going to try to hold on to it for another 17 laps. Or 16 laps now, really. I guess trying to hold the lead was easier said than done. What are you doing, man? Oh my god, he... Oh my god. Dude, you had more room on the bottom of the track. You could have, you could have just stayed down there, but no, you decided to drive up a little further than I thought you would. And it just completely shoots me up in the outside wall. I hate that. I hate that. We've already, and we dropped all the way to six. That's fantastic. All right. It's slip mode time, aka time to catch up. The that wasn't the easiest to pass for fifth, but I kind of stuck my nose in there and I tried to slide jump off the corner. Didn't quite get there, but I still clear. I still made the pass on. Him. I still cleared him, so whatever. Fourth? No, I, I was trying out. It didn't work. And the guy behind me, again, uh, tried to get under me and then slide, slide up into the wall. Outside wall, whatever. Oh my god, I'm super pissed about the guy in second right now. Okay, that's not- okay, it's not gonna slide, it's not gonna- okay. okay. Sorry, Danny Ross. The car just did not- did not want to finish that corner. I think the tires are starting to wear a bit, so that might be a problem. I think I went too far down on the tire pressure. Okay, in the inside. I get, or maybe not, because I hit the inside wall now. Oh my goodness. Alright. We, we dropped back to 1.5 seconds back. Great. I need, to see, I need to see to shut up and catch up. Like flag, final lap. And I guess after the remarks I made uh, about life and difficulty, I. I deserve, I deserve it, I mean, <laughs> I deserve to get beat, for once, but I'll take a, I'll still take a top five finish, fifth place, I'll take it. Oh, that was not the easiest win, congrats to Brady Barnes. It's not an easy race, I mean, really. Turn three skill points earned, so that's, there's that. We got a six thousand five hundred dollars in the bank. It still make five thousand dollars, so it's not bad. Uh, I'm guessing we got uh, villain points off this race, though. Yeah, hundred villain points. Air fifty two prestige points and fourteen thousand three hundred nine fans are enough, so that's good. So it's good to get the prestige points up and fans up too. 
Oh, well, it's this. Level one prestige. Okay. Alrighty. Um. <coughs> I guess we'll uh, finish this off by letting the place stand one last time and see where we, where everything stands. For the moment, because I'm interested, obviously. Right, let's see what we got here. It's definitely something that Elmer Cadwell's. But I guess we lost a little bit. Danny Ross is third. Can I go? Tony Durden, 4th, George Barnes, 5th, George Dennis is 6th, Travis Foster, Brady Barnes, Bruce Kenny, Darren Dennis is top 10, and it goes all the way down to Marvin Humphrey, still last points. Alright. Well, there's that. Uh, next uh, modified race is Mario Street Speedway, so get ready for that. And hopefully, uh, everything goes well. Um, I don't know if there'll be another modified race after that or not. Uh, we'll see. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye bye.